Okay, in this uh, video, I'm going to show you how do you write a PHP code in your blog. The reason that you would like to do that is sometimes uh, using a PHP function is far more efficient uh, than just installing a plugin and making it work. And it's much easier if you found some useful function, you can directly deploy it on your blog without even uh, finding out a plugin that can serve your job. So let us say if you want to uh, display a simple string like hello world in this area and uh, we are going to use PHP to do that. So that is just a simple example but the usage of PHP is going to be very powerful after you understood how to do it. So let us start with it. Uh, to do that uh, I'll, you go to your admin panel and uh, go to the install plugins. So you install a plugin by the name of exec PHP uh, and uh, it will enable you to write PHP code in your blog. Uh, the PHP font code is written in between these two tags. So whatever code you write uh, in PHP, you start with this and then, and then you add with this and the code uh, lies right here. So let us see how to write a very simple PHP code. For example, echoing a hello world onto your blog. So for that, we're going to go to widget section and let me open that widget for you. And I have created a, let me delete this. Okay, so I've, I've taken a very simple text widget. Let me delete this too. I've taken a very simple text widget and I am going to drag in top of the search and I'm going to call it a simple PHP output and I'm going to start writing PHP here so as you can see I have st uh, I've started with uh, a opening tag and a closing tag and I'm going to write some PHP and the most useful function in PHP is echo which outputs anything you write after this in a code to the browser whenever your page is called so here we are going to write echo and then we are going to have a single quote start and single quote end and in between we are going to write at hello world in between okay so we remove this space and then we end this statement of with a semicolon every every statement in php ends with a semicolon that's it and when we press save this widget is saved so now let us see whether the hello world has been echoed in the main block page or not so if we go here and do a refresh see pretty handy for more uh, use of this php tags and uh, and functions useful functions keep watching i'll create more videos like this thank you